The game of the week for me is the Chargers versus the Ravens. Herbert versus Jackson, two elite quarterbacks. Chargers 4-1, and one, Ravens 4-1. and one. It looks like it's going to be a great matchup. And I am stoked for it. Two quarterbacks that are young, that they're, they're peaking. This season looks like they're just getting better and better. Lamar Jackson looks like a better quarterback than his MVP year. Justin Herbert looks like an MVP candidate his second season in the league. Both of these teams have Super Bowl aspirations, and I think... You know, we should take them seriously. They're both two teams that can score point, points in bunches. They have, you know, they have some playmakers on defense. So I think this is going to be a great, great, great game. Like, I'm upset that Sunday Night Football, that the NFL doesn't allow um, games to be flexed to, like, week 12 or week 13, I believe. So this game should have been flexed, in my opinion. Like, if, if they were just able to willy-nilly move, move the matches, move the schedule... This should be the Sunday Night Football game. Um, Steelers, they're kind of boring this season. And the Seattle Seahawks without Russell Wilson, without Chris Carson. Like, how much entertain it, entertainment is that going to be? So, it is what it is. We'll watch them at 10, at 10 in the morning. We'll watch them at 1 p.m. Eastern time. But, like I said, this, this has the potential to be, you know, the game of the season, which is crazy because we've had some great matches but, you know, two heavyweights, two teams in the AFC, top of the AFC. I think the Ravens are the one seed. The Chargers are the two seed if the season ended today. And both the Chargers and the Ravens already beat the Chiefs. We'll see how the Chiefs bounce back. But this is starting to look like, you know, like they're duking it out. I know it's week six, but it looks like they they might be duking it out for that number one spot in the AFC. And if you guys don't know, if you guys don't remember, there's no longer two bye weeks, two teams that get bye weeks in the first week of the playoffs there's only one bye week so these this game has a lot of implication chargers four and one ravens four and one both teams have their eyes sets on that number one seed getting that bye week you play one less game in the playoffs you, you get home field advantage obviously the chargers don't really have too much of a home field advantage but i would imagine they would still rather play in sunny los angeles than you know going you know to arrowhead going to Baltimore, going to, you know, Buffalo. I would imagine that they would still rather, you know, play in Los Angeles. So, like I said, if you guys have one match, if you guys have one match in you for this weekend, it has to be Chargers versus Ravens. You got to keep up with the health of Mike Williams. He's been great for the Chargers. We'll see how, if he's able to suit up. But, like I said, this this has all the all the makings of a green match. Herbert versus Jackson. Uh, hopefully they could get a little rivalry going. Like I've said before, Herbert versus Mahomes is going to be one of the best um, rivalries, probably the best rivalry ever between two quarterbacks in one division. But we have a lot of good quarterbacks in the AFC. I'm talking Herbert. I'm talking Jackson, Josh Allen, Mahomes. Um, we'll see how these other young quarterbacks do, like um, Joe Burrow and... Um, And uh, who am I forgetting? Um, the Jaguars quarterback, uh, Trevor Trevor Lawrence. We'll see how Trevor Lawrence does. But there's a lot of good young quarterbacks in the AFC, but I think these four are just going to start building their own rivalries between them. Herbert, Jackson, um, Josh Allen, and Mahomes. I think all four of those are just going to have some sort of rivalry with each other. Um, Herbert and Mahomes seems inevitable, but Jackson and... Herbert or Jackson and Josh Allen, I think they're all just going to have important matches for their whole careers. Um, a lot of meaningful playoff games, a lot of meaningful regular season matches because they're, they're all super young. They're all, you know, they're all about to get their max contracts. They're all, to be, they're all about to be leading their teams to the playoffs year in and year out. So I'm excited. Herbert versus Jackson for the first time. What do you guys think? Who's going to win? Chargers versus Ravens. I think I'm going to say the Chargers just because, you know, they they handle the Browns. But the Ravens, oh, the Ravens, I think the Chargers have more weapons. I think Jackson has to do more with less with the Ravens. And Herbert, in my opinion, is just as good a quarterback. Jackson has improved in passing, but Herbert just looks so natural in the pocket running. Obviously, Jackson is a better runner, but Herbert does have the better supporting cast on offense. The defense, Ravens has the, the edge, but 
Overall, I think it's just going to be a great match. I can't wait to see this. I am super pumped. Just two good offenses, two great teams duking it out for that number one spot in week six in the AFC. Let me know what you guys think. I think Chargers win a close one. It's going to go down to the wire. 